Okay, I'm going to show you the uh, tools that we have available within Languages at Work for assessment uh, to make marking quicker and easier. Um, Languages at Work has uh, a function called the Dual Grader. I've come here into uh, a test course that we use for um, testing our uh, software and making sure things are working as they should, just to give you a quick demonstration. So I'm logged in as the tutor, and if I click on the three bars here up on the top right, I'm going to be able to see the dual grader. So the dual grader function takes me straight into all assignments. And uh, as I can see here with the filters, each of the assignments is listed. And next to that is the name of the student who submitted an assignment. So I've chosen this assignment um, where I've just put a, an example to show you. So according to how you set the assignment up with the assignment settings, you'll then have the opportunity to um, download and mark as you prefer. And using the dual grader, you'll be able to very quickly move from one assignment to the next. So in this case, the uh, submission that it's showing me here is from this student and I know it requires grading. There's a file here for me to download. Um, if there were multiple files, then I would click download all files and that will put them into a zipped folder um, for me to get hold of the um, electronic files that have been submitted. Now, when I've downloaded the file and looked at it, or I can simply view it in line, if, so let me show you what that looks like. You can see here it's an image file that's been submitted. Uh, and I can look at it here. This will be displayed whether it's an image or a PDF. Um, the inline grading means that you don't need to download and then re-upload. You can actually mark from uh, the screen that you're on. So then I would put a mark on here and uh, add some feedback. And all I need to do then is to there may be a file perhaps I want to upload, so perhaps some additional information. But then all I need to do is to save that grade. And what you can see there is I've got an update here, grade successfully updated. And if I want to see anything else that needs grading, I can click show uh, submissions requiring grading. And here you can see that I've got through all my marking load in this course.